my mind to fill with the anticipation of what is coming for me today. The different meetings, tasks that need to get done. Holy Spirit, that you are orchestrating it all. The game plan for today is it is like 10 30 honestly it's probably 10 15 but it is after 10 o'clock and i do tend to wake up later on fridays just because it's the end of the week i don't have classes and it's kind of just like a weekend for me hopefully you can stay like that next semester already kind of late i'm going to jump into some work for youtube right now i have about two videos that i really want to finish editing or at least start and then I also have a an exam that I want to study for. Um, I have until Monday night to take it, but I'd rather take it sooner than later. And I'm also going to get dressed. This is the little outfit of the day. And now I'm going to jump into some work. I also have to hand in an assignment that I already finished, but I just keep forgetting to turn it in. So I'm going to turn that in, and then I'm going to get started on my day. Okay, so if you guys are curious, my assignment that I had to turn in, so we had a class, this is for American Studies, of course, we had to look through all these monuments that were up of like historical figures, and then we had to like vote on whether we would ha have the statue taken down or left up, and I think it was like so silly. I understand the principle of the activity but i really think that it was just i don't really care like if like it's it's a statue it's not a, a living person it, it doesn't bother anybody some of the statues that were up i couldn't even believe like why would you make a statue for that person that is so stupid i just had to take a picture of my notes and turn them in on canvas and then i do to study for my counseling psych exam but i think i'm gonna do that later I just have to just put away my homework because I'm really not a homework at night person. I just want to get a head start. I did put away all my highlighters and pens, but I did keep my Bible out for this specific purpose. And today I just read a couple Psalms, but my favorite one by far is Psalm 103. You guys should definitely go read it. My favorite verse from here is right here. Praise the Lord my soul and forget not all his benefits, who forgives all your sins and heals all your diseases, and who redeems you, your life from the pit. So that just goes on. I definitely recommend you guys read that. I want to say that I have been feeling like really stressed out because I don't even think like my schedule move out time is from one to three and I don't think anyone can come up here to get me at that time. Um, I thought things would be different when I signed up, but things changed. So I'm not really sure what I'm going to do. I may have to move out later. Um, just hopefully I don't have to stay here until tomorrow because all my stuff is already out. So just reading the word made me feel a lot more calm. I just recorded an entire thing and I realized that I wasn't recording at all. So that's pretty funny. Okay. Hi guys. So it is me and I just finished editing over there, but I'm not finished finished, but I got the rough cut done. Right now I'm going to take down these lights because I don't have another night in here. Um, and then I am going to head over to main campus for my last supper of the semester, my last meal. Um, and then I'm going to come back and like take this out, take my TV down and all that like last minute extra good stuff. My mom is actually coming to get me. My move out slot is from one to three, but I have a feeling it's going to be a little bit later than that. But yeah, so she's going to come and get me and I'm really happy about that because it'll be during the day. And yeah, life is good and we're gonna go eat. I have no idea how I reached this. Oh look, look at that. Come on. Oh, gotcha. Ooh. Why are there so many command strips, guys? What did I what was I doing here? I think 
people are watching me from outside the window. So. Where's the mirror? They need to get the mirror. Okay, guys, so. Okay, so. I'm looking like a crazy hot mess right now, but before I leave, I wanted to look in both of my roommates' rooms because, like, I was never really in there, and I wanted to see, like, how they look in comparison to mine because I'm just curious. I want to take a look. This is roommate number one's room. So she had huge windows. Oh my gosh, she's like more space. And she. Dang, they did her up with this closet space. That is so rude. Also, huge windows. Oh my gosh. And they also had real closets. And this was supposed to be a double room, so she had this much bed space. And she's got... Wow, I'm like almost jelly. But I like that my room was not right next to the bathroom, because these ones are, but... There you guys go, the full apartment tour. <laughs> The first thing I'm gonna do is my bed. I'm taking everything off, and then we are going to tackle that TV, which I have a feeling is going to be really difficult. But after I do that, all I have to do is clean up all my roommates' trash that they left behind, and then we are ready to take stuff to the car. Guys, I promise I don't actually dance like that. We are currently moving stuff out right now. My little sister is helping me, and it looks a lot worse than it actually is, I promise. We are finally done. Bad hot mess. There's no light in here either. So I gotta hurry up before the cloudy sunlight goes away. And we are gonna tackle this entire room today. And I'll show you guys what the after is. You know what? I should do a cute little transition look. 